so we can use what we know about circles to figure out the angles of a circle. To go all the way around a circle is 360 degrees. Let's look at this first example. This circle is broken up into six. If I want to find out what the angle of one sixth is, I'm going to take 360 degrees and I'm going to divide by six because that circle is broken into six pieces. And I know that 36 divided by six is six and I'm going to place the zero. So 360 divided by six equals 60, which means each of these angles is 60 degrees. I can check my work by adding 60 degrees six times, which will equal 360. So for this other example, now my circle is broken into one, two, three, ninths. So to figure out what one pi piece measures, I'm going to do 360 total degrees divided by nine pieces, 36 divided by nine is four, and there's one zero, so I'm gonna place a zero. 360 divided by nine is 40, so 40 is the number of degrees of each pie piece. To figure out the shaded ones, I'm gonna to need to add 40 degrees eight times, or I could do 40 degrees times eight, and four times eight is 32, and place the zero. So all these shaded pieces would equal 320 degrees, but each pie piece is 40 degrees.